My mother was diagnosed with breast cancer and that was a very trying time for all of us. I'm Lauren Tanaby and I am postdoctoral research fellow at Wayne State University in the lab of Dr. Karen List. I was fascinated by the research I was doing, but I wasn't passionate about it. It wasn't very personal for me. Um, so I decided to switch over to the cancer field um, because I wanted to be part of the next generation of researchers that was able to kind of develop more drugs and find targets for um, cancers that were particularly challenging, such as inflammatory breast cancer, which is what we now study. My mom with my uh, daughter Grace, who almost two, and um, my mom was very lucky. She had stage one uh, invasive ductal carcinoma. She's able to pop a pill every day, and she's been cancer-free for five years, and she's going to be with us for a long time. Um, I had many other women in my family who have also struggled with cancer, um, and I, you know, kind of what keeps me going is, you know, I want to be sure that my daughter never has to go through this, and I worry that one day I'll have to go through this. Given the current economic climate, we are extraordinarily grateful for everything that American Cancer Society, volunteers, staff, fundraisers have done for us. Um, I think of science as one giant collaboration. It's not just a collaboration between the scientists in the lab, it's a collaboration between other labs, and it's also a collaboration between labs and American Cancer Society and the fundraisers that are out there every day trying to raise money so that we can find cures for these diseases. I would like to just say thank you to all of the American Cancer Society um, staff, volunteers, relayers who work so very hard every day to try to raise money to eradicate uh, these awful diseases. Thank you.